Hello everyone, Artitya here and today's video is about my weekend project and the project is I'm going to turn this LCD panel here from my old laptop that I turned into a mini desktop PC in the previous video so I'm going to turn this into a secondary monitor for my PC or my laptop so let's start working on it For this project, you're gonna need an LCD panel like this. Search for model number on your LCD panel. You're gonna need this model number for later. After you know your model number, you can search online for a controller board set compatible for your LCD panel. Make sure you've got the right LVDS cable for your LCD panel, like mine for example. My LCD panel needs an IPEX 40 pin LVDS cable. Like usual, I'm going to use MDF for the base of my LCD panel. I'm going to put this LCD panel onto the MDF board. So I'm able to know how big for the base I'm going to need. You might want to mark the MDF to make a hole for the cables. Okay, now everything is set up and I'm going to do a magic fingers now. See, it fits perfectly as I want it to be. Now, let's decide how's the controller board to be placed. I spent a half hour to make this decision. I'm going to use this double-sided tape to attach the controller board. For the LCD panel, I'm going to use this smaller double-sided tape. Attach double-sided tape onto the other side of the LCD panel. You can attach these buttons anywhere you want, but for me, I'm going to attach this on the front side. Don't forget to connect the LVDS cable.
all parts were attached and let's tidy up the cable. I'm going to use this electric tape to make the cables look better. The cable all are fixed to its place, now let's power up this thing. I'm using this 12 volt power source cable to power up the monitor. I'm gonna use this power bank as the power source. Well, it's turned on, and let's try to connect this to my laptop. I already connected it to my laptop, and it looks like this. Well, I'm using a tablet holder as a monitor stand, but you can make your own monitor stand if you like. It works really great, and I'm pretty happy about it. Well, that's how I made this, and is it worth it? Yeah, if you have unused LCD panel laying around in your house, yep, it's worth it. But if you don't, you can buy an LCD panel from online store as a spare part, and you can choose any LCD panel you want. Okay, that's about it, and if you like this channel, you can hit that like button, and you can hit that subscribe button too, it will be great. Anyway, I'm RDPI here and this is my weekend project. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.